I st- to this day, I still wake up in the morning and thank God. The Crossroads Mission Recovery Program helps addicts put their life back together, one piece at a time, one day at a time. Been using for years, um, lost a lot, family, kids. Um, so I was desperate. Met a couple of good people in here, kind of hung out with them and they've kind of showed me my way. It's not an overnight process, it's a progression. The road to recovery requires a lot of dedication and support from friends, family, and the community. I mean, not even my best day using is compared to to my worst day sober. And that's just the easy way to look at it. Garcia says when he was caught, he had two choices. He was either crossroads or prison. Uh, I did five months, I got sent to the drug court. As part of my drug court, they sent me here to the substance abuse program. Uh, I guess you could say a light flicked on. Garcia used methamphetamine for 20 years. It took me months to actually get my head straight, you know, and even now I still have my slip-ups, but you know, I don't, I don't use or, or drink over my slip-ups. It's still a process. I still learn every day. At the end of the day, I still, you know, go back and look at my day and see how I could go about things different, you know, when I do make mistakes and stuff like that. Do you think it was a blessing that you were arrested then? Oh yes, totally. Not everyone's path to the mission is the same, but as they travel down the road to recovery, people learn to enjoy their life sober. (laughs) I have a good life. I never thought I would be able to take care of two kids, full-time job, um, live on my own, pay my own bills, and be clean and sober. When Gonzalez's son was born, he was immediately taken away from her because he was born addicted to meth. Did it ever cross your mind when you were pregnant about what that was possibly? Like? Yes, it did. But when you're using drugs, you don't really think about stuff like that. You know, you're just not thinking about it. Gonzalez fought hard to get her son back into her custody. The mission had a lot to do with it. Like they, um, the support here, Um, Crossroads helped Gonzalez by giving her a job. I didn't know anybody here until I came to the mission. Gonzalez has been clean two years, but it took the entire two years to get her son back. She completed substance abuse classes, parenting classes, and a drug test once a week. It's good. I'm happy. Really happy. You don't have to worry about this stuff when you're using drugs. Like, I mean, really don't worry about anything but dumb stuff. But now you're just, um, you don't have worries like that, you know when you're going to get high or how you're going to get high or you don't really think about your kids. It's a lot different now. She is getting closer to her family once again. You really don't want to be around family when you're addicted to drugs because they know who they know you and they know how you are and they're going to know. So you just close yourself off to your family. Most addicts do. I got a good story.